Now, as I just mentioned on India and US relations, External Affairs Minister S. Jay Shankar actually hailed the two nations' bilateral ties. He said that India and the United States have moved to a position where we really see each other as very desirable, optimal partners, comfortable partners. So the chemistry and the comfort today of the relationship gives me enormous hope about where the prospects are. Listen in to the full statement that have been made by uh, External Affairs Minister S. Jay Shankar. The various discussions that I have been in, I am often asked saying, okay, you know, you have done this a long time, so tell us where do you think this relationship is going? Now, it is hard for me today really to put a limit on it, to define it, to even voice expectations, because in every way, I mean, ask yourselves, I mean, many of you came some of you would have come here more recently, many of you have been here longer, all of you have tracked the relationship because this relationship is after all your own story. Ask yourself what did you think three years ago, five years ago, ten years ago and would you not agree with me that today in every way this relationship has exceeded expectations, which is why today we don't even try to define it, we actually keep raising the bars we keep finding new domains, we, we keep, you know, the more we do with each other, the more we find we are able to, uh, to do, to uh, explore together, to achieve together. I would say today India and the United States have moved to a position where we really see each other as very desirable, optimal partners comfortable partners with whom it's a natural instinct today. So the chemistry and the comfort today of the relationship, this today gives me enormous hope about where the prospects are. CNN News 18, Siddhant Mishra continues to be with me on the phone line. Siddhant, coming back to you, what was the occasion where External Affairs Minister actually talked about the comfort that India and US shares with each other? Also, I want to understand from you uh, that uh, isn't it very crucial for External Affairs Minister to make such a statement on a global platform because we have invited President Joe Biden to attend the Republic Day celebrations next year as well? Look, you know, uh, India and U.S. Has a, has a great understanding, perhaps we are the strategic partners, and especially after Prime Minister Modi's visit to the United States uh, in June, and then Joe Biden's visit to India for G20, and on the sidelines of it, uh, there was a bilateral which took place between the two leaders. So India and U.S. are perhaps collaborating in a lot of areas, which includes, uh, which includes defense, which includes, uh, 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 which includes uh, 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 you know, semiconductor, which also includes uh, uh, the, uh, the cutting edge technology. We have a lot of uh, uh, a lot of programs that have been combined, uh, that have been mutually, uh, you know, announced. So there is a lot going on between India and Canada, uh, India and and United States, and it's very important to recreate uh, it and perhaps the confidence that India has on United States and United States uh, reciprocate the same, especially at times. When there have been multiple reports of uh, of, of U.S. Uh, you know uh, perhaps making statement on the killings of uh, Hardeep Singh or Canada trying to loop in U.S. Uh, and and you know uh, and and uh, and in a way trying to tell the U.S. that uh, look what India is doing making false accusation. So it's very important to recreate that uh, uh, that India is committed uh, to Indo-Pacific. India is committed to the safety and stability of the region and same is the goal of United States of America. So this time around again when uh, S.J. Shankar uh, has gone to U.S. Uh, to attend UNGA, post his uh, commitments at UNGA, he went to D.C., he had meeting with Secretary of Defense, he had meeting with Secretary of State and perhaps all American counterparts he met and, uh, and all of them discussed uh, the progress that have been made since Prime Minister Modi's uh, visit uh, to uh, D.C. in the month of June. Back to you. All right, Siddhan, since it's a developing story, we'll come back to you for more updates right now. Thank you so much.